What's going on here today, Ryan? We have the Food Bank of America, where the Bank of America used to be. So instead of um, people doing financial transactions in the bank, using ATMs, um, putting their money into an institution, which then invests that money in things like now to top Google, um, forecloses on people's homes, things like this. Instead, we're using this physical space as a space where we can come together as a community, we can eat with each other, share food. It's a location where people know that they can bring meals to share with each other. And um, we think that's a lot better use of space for this area than, than the Bank of America. And I think um, you can see just from the difference in how many people are here versus how many people visit this ATM when it's just an ATM or visit this bank when it's just a bank really shows the community support seems to be for, for food and for community, not for, for banking and for yeah, world trade. Can I ask uh, what these different dishes are? May I ask what this is, sir? This is rice. Squash and broccoli. Thank you very much. Hi, Megan. Hi. What's this dish? Can you please um, tell yeah, me? Yeah, this dish is a beautiful pasta dish with a homemade puttanesca bread sauce. Mm -hmm. It also has some eggplant, completely vegetarian, uh, made by someone that's famous from Italy, so it's uh, truly Italian. Wow. Yeah, and then this is a beautiful salad. It looks really good. Broccoli, cabbage, um, tomatoes, some apple. You know, pretty much we're trying to create delicious and nutritious meals. Um, all of this was donated by uh, co-ops, cooperative wow. grocery stores. Um, therefore, we are giving back to the community by buying from them and not buying. So we're all trying to buy local.